Welcome back subscribers and hello YouTube viewers. On this occasion we're off to a town called Deans Marsh. Deans Marsh is a rural farming township 134 kilometres or 83.2 miles southwest of Melbourne, the state capital of Victoria, Australia. The township is also 4 kilometres or 2.4 miles north of the Great Otway National Park. It is at the junction of the roads from Colac and Winchelsea where they converge southwards to the surf coast township of Lawn on the Great Ocean Road where it is a mere 23 kilometres or 14 miles away. Dean's Marsh was probably named after Charles Dean who held a grazing licence in the area from about 1846. Surveyed farms were taken up during the early 1860s and a school was opened in 1865. The Dean's Marsh Post Office opened on the 3rd of November 1866 and a store was built in 1868. In the late 1870s, Lawn became a popular resort. Eskin House and Lawn Hotel were opened in 1878 and the Dean's Marsh Hotel was a coach stop on the journey. Within the next 10 years, Dean's Marsh gained an Anglican church in 1884, a public hall and an extension of the railway line from Birangura, if that's how you pronounce it. And I do apologise if I don't pronounce anything correctly. The Forest Railway Line, which branched from the Warnable Line at Burungura, was opened to Deans Marsh on the 19th of December 1889 and was extended to Forest on the 5th of June 1891. The line was closed on the 4th of March 1957. During the next 40 years, Dean Marsh experienced a mixture of closures and new institutions. The butter factory and the hotel were closed by 1924, but a sports pavilion, Methodist church and a motor garage was opened. Dean's Marsh is part of the Otway Harvest Trail and the Penny Royal Raspberry Farm and the Gentle Annie Berry Gardens are nearby. There are three wineries in the area, Blake's Estate, Dinigunan and Gosling Creek. Also located in Dean's Marsh is Yan Yan Gert West, a sheep farm known for its 1880s wool shed and innovative practices in regenerative agriculture and agroforestry. Dean's Marsh has a general store, a hall, a primary school, an Anglican church and a cafe. There is a commemorative plaque at a cottage where the renowned Wagnerian soprano operatic singer Marjorie Lawrence was born and she was from 1907 to 1979. Dean's Marsh is mentioned in Lawrence's autobiography. The store Dean's Marsh is a tea room, grocery, deli, cafe and cake shop with a vegetarian garden, post office, news agency and info centre. Now for those who would like to seek further information, I have uh, left a link in the description below where I source the information, including the photos. So it'll all be there if you want to find out where you can get a little bit more information than what I've just spoken about. So without further ado, let's check out Dean's Marsh. Yeah. 
So here we are nearing the end of this presentation. Uh, any credits and links will be in the description below to where I sourced the information. Uh, and if you did like it, by all means, give us that thumbs up, hit that like key, and please subscribe. Subscribing doesn't cost you one cent, and it really does help the channel immensely. But most importantly, stay safe, commute safe, and have a great day.